Autumn is here, the darker nights are rolling in, storms are raging outside and this is the time of year that I like to make my home really cosy and warm and this is where I have all my home fragrance. So let me talk to you about Avon home fragrance. We've got reed diffusers, candles, wax melts, fragrance oils, scented sachets and car diffuser refills too. So let me show you. First, let me know what you prefer. Do you prefer diffusers or wax melts or both, all of it? Do you like to have the same fragrance in every room or do you like different fragrances in every room? So now I'm gonna show you all the different scents of the home fragrances and share some of the diffusers and candles and wax melts with you. First up is fresh cotton. Now this is the large jar candle and it's got the old style on the front, but fresh cotton is green apple, orange blossom and musk. So it's a really fresh and breezy scent. Next is white jasmine and neroli. And I have been using this one because I've, I'm obsessed with the smell of jasmine. I absolutely love it. Just makes me think of when you're on holiday in the evening and you get the fresh scent of jasmine wafting over you. So this is jasmine, gardenia and neroli. It's a fresh floral fragrance. I also use the fragrance oil as well. And with this, you add it into your burner, add water and then put your candle underneath. Next is lavender and bergamot, which I don't have, but I have tried. It is gorgeous. It's eucalyptus, bergamot and lavender. So it's quite a relaxing, quite a fresh, soothing smell. And next you've got vanilla and tonka bean. Now this is the scented diffuser. I haven't opened it yet, but I will be putting this because I like to switch over my scent to like vanilla because I think that's warm and cozy. So this is vanilla, almonds and tonka beans and it gives you that cozy, rich, warm scent in your home. Next you've got the aromatherapy essential oil collection. Now, these scents are slightly stronger and these can turn your home into a little retreat or they're really nice if you're having like a spa evening or a spa day. I've got the relaxation diffuser and I've also got the candle. I'm just going to read from the brochure the scents of these because I can't remember them. <laughs> so... The relaxation is soothing basil, lemon and cedarwood. You, oh, forgot to mention, you can have the diffuser, the candle and the essential oil for these. The next one is time for focus. That's stimulating basil, black pepper and rosemary. So that's lovely if you want to um, like focus. I used to have the focus one in my office, but I've used it all. So this is green, herbaceous and spicy. And the last one is the Time for Sleep collection, relaxing lavender, clary sage and chamomile. So this has got that soothing, relaxing scent. And there they all are. And we also do diffusers in the Far Away fragrances. And this is the always today tomorrow always and we've also got the original home far away fragrance now top tip with diffuser think about when you're using a diffuser think about where you place it because you don't want to place it somewhere where it's going to be knocked over but you also want to get the scent of it so i would place mine on a unit but we're you, you'll be walking past. So that will help to waft the scent around the room. And also, if you're putting your diffuser in a large room, then use all of the reeds. But if you're placing it into a smaller room, like you might have a, like a downstairs toilet or ensuite bathroom, you don't have to use all of the reeds because you can just use two or three in that because it's, it's a smaller room. So 
it'll smell stronger. So I hope these have helped you guys and hope you like my top tips with the diffuser. Let me know what you use in your home. And yeah, it's autumn, time for cozy season.